Hey, it's Marcel, and I wanted to ask you another question, and this one today is around the theme of love. The question is, what makes you lovable? Now, for example, I had a grandmother who's no longer with us, but I loved how she would bring the whole family together and do these big meals at Thanksgiving and Christmas, and I think probably a few birthdays too. But we, she was a connector, and she cooked, and she baked, and she created these experiences that I loved. And I don't know if I was always that grateful then because I was a little tiny tune at the time, but I loved that she brought us all together for these huge meals. Or what else might make you lovable? Another example I have is a pastor I used to learn from. He was very intentional. Like he was not spontaneous at all, but he was very, very intentional. And he literally wrote it in his calendar every you know, first Thursday or Tuesday of the month to bring his wife flowers. And I was like, oh, that's just, you know, to me that was very lovable of him for her. I thought that was very sweet that he was intentional because he knew he wasn't a creative or a spontaneous person, but he was very intentional and that might make you lovable. Maybe you're a very intentional person. And then another thing, so this is what makes me lovable in my opinion, is I tend to have a very positive, optimistic, encouraging outlook on life. Like for example, at Laugh Tech the other night, I told a joke about how I was kind of bummed because I had got new pants and I wasn't really thrilled with the size. And, and at the end of the little joke, I said, you know what, I realized I don't need a man to tell me I, I'm a perfect 10. My jeans tell me I'm a perfect 10. <laughs> and I thought it was really funny and I just, you know, I'm not saying I don't have negative moments or sad spots, but I try to really, really hard to think of, well, what's good about this? What's the lesson? Where's the fun in it? And I think that's something that makes me lovable. So what about you? What makes you lovable? Leave me a comment below if you're feeling courageous or send me a private message. And I am wishing you lots of love every day, not just on Valentine's Day, but every day this year and every year moving forward.